Hi guys, I'm Joey and I'm here to do a Christmas tag. I want to do a couple of these this season. I also want to do a New Year's tag. They have so many different holiday tags. I'm going to start doing this now. Um, so yeah. So the lipstick, just to start everything off with, the lipstick I have, um, Christmas Cookie by Jeffree Star. Um, and then a lip gloss on top of it. Damn Gina by Kylie Jenner's. Kylie Cosmetics. So yeah, they're similar colors. It's just, they're really similar if you look close at it. But it's just, this is, the Kylie has the gloss and it's glitter and this is just a matte canvas. But it's the same color, so that's why I mixed the two of them. Um, do you like my jacket, guys? Do you like my jacket? Oh my god, I'm so like, oh my god. Move you guys. I don't know why, but this camera's just not cooperating right today. Don't get why. Okay, so, um, yeah. So, before I even get started, this has been a horrible fucking day. I mean, seriously. Um, before I even start with the Christmas tag, maybe I shouldn't even put this in the beginning because this is not holly jolly at all. This is not nothing festive. Um, but I had a presentation today that I did. Now, we all got together yesterday and went over it. Me and my, my group. And we went over it, went over it, and I messed up. The whole time, we went over the second question. I have two questions. The first question I did fine. The second question, I kept messing up. And I was like, shit. So, I went home, redoing it, redoing it, redoing it, redoing it, right? Like, the whole night. Like, like I've never seen this before. I've never studied so much for one fucking sentence. I have to say one sentence, for God's sakes. I don't get if it was nerves or what it was, but I just could not get it right. So, I presented it today. Today, I was in front of the class, and we presented and I, um, uh, I, the first question I did, I got, I was fine. Like, I was nervous, but I went through it and I didn't choke. The second question, I started off right, and then I choked. Like, I did all the other times before that when I was, I, I don't know why, but I always choked on the second question. And I don't get why. Like, I don't know if it's a tongue twister to me, if it's nerves, if it's, I have learning disabilities, so maybe it's that. I don't know what it is. But for some weird reason, this last question that I had to present, uh, I don't know, just fucking understand it. It just was a hassle. It was a fucking hassle. And it pisses me off that you work so hard for something and it still doesn't happen for you. I mean, really piss. It's going to go down as one of my most embarrassing, ridiculous, stupid moments of my life. I'm never going to let this one down. Yeah, so that's that. I mean, probably I shouldn't have started off with that, but whatever. Let's get into the Christmas questions now. Um, so there's 13 questions. And the first one is, what makes the holidays special to you? Oh, by the way, this is called the Happy Holidays YouTube tag question. Now, I don't know if I've done this. I've done a Holly Jolly one before. I, I don't know if this is the same question. I really didn't look at I don't like to look at the questions because I feel like it's rehearsed. And I'd rather just read the questions for the first time on camera and then answer them authentically. But, okay, so the first question is, what makes the holidays special for you? The holiday special to me is probably the, um... Just family, um, the fact that everything looks different. Like, when you go outside, it's not a normal world anymore. It's transformed into this Christmas land. Like, everything has Christmas lights, everyone is, you know, there's Christmas carols. Not on my black, but there's Christmas carols, there's, um, people shopping until they drop in the super, in, in, in the supermarkets in the in the um in the, yeah in the grocery stores in the um in the grocery stores too but mostly you know at the mall and stuff they get their presents and um yeah I mean everyone's just in a better mood like the, the Christmas music starts playing on the radio you know it really starts to feel like Christmas it starts to get much colder like it just feels like there's a nip in the air Christmas is here, um, and that's what it is. So, um, that's what I like about it, is that I feel like everything's different. I feel like, I feel like for, for one month, everything just seems so happy and just seems so, just seems so, like, different. Like, I feel like it's a different, we're living in a different world when December hits. And then once December ends, we're back to the same old bullshit. So, favorite holiday song, second one is the favorite holiday song. Hmm. 
I think this, I said this is my last tag years ago and I'm gonna say it again. I think it's forever will be um, Britney Spears, my only wish this year. Even though there's a Clay Aiken Christmas song that I found recently called Don't Save It All for Christmas Day. And I really like that one. I like the one in Beauty and the Beast. I know this is weird and this is just random, but I do like the song that's played in Beauty and the Beast, the, the Christmas Beauty and the Beast movie. I think it's called um, As Long As There's Christmas, and I really like, I really like that song. Like, I really like that song. There's a few Christmas songs, but nothing generic. Like, I don't like any of the generic songs of Let It Snow, or I'll Be Home For Christmas, or, you know, all the, all the typical, you know, Santa Claus is coming down, as far as the stomach, I like all those, like, it's just not my thing. I like the more, like, unique, individual Christmas songs. So the next one is Favorite Holly Makeup Trends. Oh, I picked the right one. I picked the because this is this is me over here. Favorite holiday makeup trend. I don't know what that means. Makeup trend. I'm thinking like okay. My favorite holiday makeup trend now all year round. There's two things. My eyes. I never put glitter on my eyes. Now I just started getting the, still a glitter eyeshadows, and I may do it all year round. But the holiday season, I just love glitter on your eyes. Like it's just so pretty and festive, especially for the new year. I just think the whole thing is so pretty, and I think. I don't know, I just absolutely love um, glitter eyeshadow. I feel like it looks more festive. Like, I feel like with Christmas, there's glitter on everything. Like, the packages, the bows, decorations, there's glitter all over the place. There's the garland sparkly, you know. Like, Christmas is time to sparkle, to glitter, to glam. And that's basically what I do for my eyes with the glitter still eyeshadow. Now, for lips... My trend for lips is dark, and I know I have a nude on right now, but I wanted to try the new Christmas, the, the Jeffree Star holiday collection, so I did put on this. But I usually do dark lips for the Christmas time, like red berry colors, so I'm definitely going to delve deep into Poinsettia, Jeffree Star lipstick, and the Santa Baby one from Jeffree Star. Those two I'm going to delve in deep this holiday season, where each, I'm going to wear one for Christmas Eve, one for Christmas Day, and then I'm thinking, like, even for New Year's, I'm going to wear one, like, I'm going to wear one try to wear one all of the winter season. I'm going to wear like a dark berry color. Um, still I'll wear my nudes because I love my nudes, but trendy for me is dark berry lips for the winter time and Christmas time. Okay, so the fourth question is where do you usually spend your holiday? Okay, so I'm going to just spill some drama here. I normally spend it here at the house. But, it got so bad at this house, like, it's so awkward and uncomfortable. I'm not even going to go into detail, but that's all you need to know. It's just really bad. So, we, I spend the holidays, my brother spend the holidays now with, on Staten Island with my grandma. Now, we always did Christmas Eve, but on Christmas Day, we've done here, but I can't just be here anymore. It's kind of really bad. So, I decide on Christmas to go to my grandma's again. <clears throat> and this year, I might do something even more different. I might go... I might go to my cousin's house, my second cousin's house. Um, I went there one Christmas. I really liked, I liked it, but uh, I may go there this Christmas. But they normally have it here. I mean, they meaning you know who, my dad and you know who. Like they, they have it here. But that's not my holiday. My Christmas is not here with them. Um, so colorful lights or white lights? Ooh, that's a hard one. Cause you know I love colorful things, but white lights is so classic and just so Christmas and just a Christmas staple and classic. So I guess I'll go with the white lights. I do like colorful lights more in general, just in general, but white lights, I feel like I like more for the holiday season. Do you celebrate Christmas? This is the eighth question. Yes, I celebrate Christmas. Um, yeah. That's a weird question to put in. It's called, well, it's called the Happy Holidays tag. So I guess they mean, oh, I see. It's, they keep saying holiday and then they say, do you celebrate Christmas? Okay. So do they say, do you celebrate Hanukkah in this thing? No, they don't. Okay. So yeah, I celebrate Christmas, um, it's just simple as that, I'm Catholic. <laughs> um, share family holiday tradition. I guess it's the generic holiday traditions, which, um, which is, you know, opening presents in the morning, um, I know we've done that, we did that for a while, like, even, like, when we were older, like, you late teens, we would go run down and open up presents. Like, we kept that tradition alive for many years. Um, but back in the day, we would bake a lot, you know, my grandma's for Christmas Eve. 
Um, my cousins used to put on their pajamas and then go to, um, just because they lived right down the block, so they put on their pajamas to go right home. We lived a little further, so we didn't put our pajamas on at our grandma's house and then went home. Like, we just stayed in our clothes. But, um, yeah, I mean, it was Christmas Eve, and then the next day, open up presents, go to my, my aunt's house uh, in Long Island for Christmas day, um... But holiday traditions, like, meaning, like, oh, did, did we decorate gingerbread houses? Like, I don't know. Like, did we wrap presents together? Nothing like that. Like, it was just a generic opening up presents on Christmas morning. We spent time with the family every year, and that was basically it. My mom said the family was Christmas Eve, and my dad said the family was Christmas Day. Um, most memorable holiday moment. I guess it was... A few of the times when I opened up presents, like, you know, the presents that I remember as a kid when I used to get so excited for was the action figures, especially the Disney ones, like the Disney action figures. Um, but something a little bit more special, like Holly Moment. I don't know. I just think a memorable holiday moment is just spending time with your family. It doesn't have to be anything specific. I think it's just like spending time with your family and just know that there's always going to be that time of year when you all will see each other again. Um, the 11th question is your favorite holiday decorations. I always love the Christmas tree decor- Oh, decorating the Christmas tree. I forgot about that. How the hell did I forget about that? That is a holiday tradition, a family holiday tradition. I don't do that anymore. Maybe that's why I forgot about it because we haven't done that in years because I definitely don't help decorate that Christmas tree. That's not my Christmas tree. That's my father's wife's Christmas tree. That's not mine. So that's why I forgot about that. But decorating the Christmas tree back in the day when I was younger, that used to be a really great holiday family tradition. So, And then we would put up like all the ornaments and all the ornaments we did in school. Like, you know, we would make ornaments in class and we would put them on the, the tree. And I just loved all that. Like, it would, it would, be, it would be different than the normal decorations that my, my mom would put up. But, like, it was just cute because it, it put something different and more fun and creative. And I was like, oh, that's what I made. You know, there's so many different ornaments we would put on it. It's so cool. I did love that. So, your yeah, favorite holiday decorations would be the Christmas tree. And I always like a nice wreath. Like, I think a wreath is really pretty on the door. And, um, I do love garland. I think it's because it's so sparkling and, like, shiny, but I love garland. Um, twelfth question. Have you ever been caught under a mistletoe? No, I have not. I've never been under a mistletoe before, I don't think. Like, n not even, like, just to, to kiss anyone. I have never been under a mistletoe. Like, just even by myself standing there. I've never been under one. I don't know why. I mean, every my family's house has never had a mistletoe. I've never been around one. So the 13th question is, hands down, what's your all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treat? Okay, holiday food would be Christmas Eve, all the Italian, because I'm Italian, so we, my grandma makes all this Italian fish, so I really like the pot, the spaghetti with the shrimp and the tomato the marinara sauce. That would be my holiday, favorite holiday food is that, that seafood on Christmas Eve. Favorite sweet treat? Holiday sweet treat. I guess it would definitely be my Aunt Debbie's pistachio Christmas cake. Every Christmas Eve she would make, and she still makes, a pistachio Christmas. She only makes it on Christmas Eve. Only on Christmas Eve. She doesn't make it any other day. She makes this, um, it's basically a shape of a Christmas tree and it's pistachio flavored cake. And then pistachio flavored pudding. It's, it's like green. It looks like a Christmas tree. And then she sprinkles decorations on it. It's so delicious. It's so cute. I think that's definitely one of them. I also like the generic candy cane. No, you know, I don't like generic candies. I like the Hershey candy canes. And I like the fruity candy canes too. And I also like um, hot cocoa. And I like, oh my god, so many. And I like home-baked chocolate chip cookies. So yeah, there's a few. And oh, I love butter, Christmas butter cookies. Oh my god. There's so many sweet treats. It's ridiculous. Yeah, okay, so that is it. That is the holiday tag. Now, I'm going to do another video tonight. I'm going to film another video. I'm going to do um, the candle haul from the Candle Day at Bath and Vida Works. I got four candles, so I'm going to do that. I may also include the one candle holder I got in that. So, yeah. That's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this tag. Again, I'm, I may do another Christmas haul. I may do another one. And then I also may do a New Year's one and stuff. So, this is not going to be the only holiday tag. What else? This Wednesday, New Jersey again, you know, um, so yes, I heard the tea. They're having 13 episodes, they're not having 12, they're having 13, so. 
and we I figured that when they didn't have the mid season trailer in episode six, I kind of I kind of figured there would be like an extra episode. So yeah, there's 13 episodes this season. So yeah, it should you know this season's really good. I mean, I think it's one of the best. But the views, oh my god, I thought that posh episode was gonna get one of the best views ever on New Jersey. It got the lowest views this season. Like the lowest viewed episode this season was that posh episode. I don't understand it. Jersey fans are just not coming through this season. Like, and they're not, they don't watch it anymore. I think this is the best season. Like, the one season you should watch is this one. And no one's watching it. Like, the views are so little. It's so crazy. Like, I feel like they're about to hit, like, below a million at this point. Like, it's so bad. And I'm like, Jersey used to be the second view, most viewed, and now it's, like, so bad. Like, what the fuck? Like, what, what the hell? So yeah, um, that's it. I'm gonna go because I've been rambling on. This video is probably so long and I have to do the Bath and Body Works uh, candle video so I need a lot of storage on my camera for that. Well, they're not a lot because there's only four candles. Alright, I love you guys. Bye.